What is poppin' and machoppin' my bagel bites? It is Mr. Bagel Bites here bringing you a what is this the second second episode of the GS Chronicles random extreme randomizer hardcore nuzlocke. Uh, in the previous episode, we got a few encounters. I'll go ahead and do the team recap here real quick, and uh, yeah, kind of go over that. Started our journey, Cricketot gang, blah blah blah. You know, you know. If you haven't checked it out, you should definitely check it out. So we got Stormwick, our heat more here with portal power. I still don't know what that ability is from. I'm guessing it is a hidden ability of uh, of a uh, Hoopa. So if that is, I don't know, or if anybody can tell me what the ability is, because I've never heard of it. With U-Turn, Technoblast, Bolt Beak, and Guillotine, we got Cyborg, our Solosis here, Assist, Overdrive, Bone Rush with Storm Drain ability. Pretty cool. We got our starter, Darkstone, with Contrary here, the Giratina, Surging Strikes, Heal Pulse, Arm Thrust, Transform. Not the best move set. Also, this would be Surging Strike, not Surging Strikes. It lied to me. It makes me sad. I definitely think Stormwick's going to be a hard carry for some time. Uh, I think for this episode, we should be able to get at least a couple encounters, have a few battles. Uh, how are we looking on balls? I also went ahead and finally put the berries in the game, so we should be good on that. Um, five? Okay. Alright, so, so we got some stuff. Let's go ahead and... Did I... What was it again? Was that 40? 40 and 1. That should be plenty. I actually think we have a few trainers to battle before we can get an encounter anyway. So let's go ahead and head up and see what we can get into. We already got our 30 encounter. This is where we got heat more. We have nothing really for this. So we're just going to go ahead and run ahead again. Got it. But if you guys are excited for today's episode, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button to stay up to date on Mr. Bagel Bites content. Super helps out the channel and myself. So I hope you consider doing that. Make some sweet, sensual, consensual love to that like and subscribe button. But let's go ahead and see what the bug catcher Don has. Donnie here. That could be a problem. Um, I don't know what it has. Well, we probably outspeed. So Bolt Beak does like 160 or something, doesn't it, when you outspeed? Yeah, we outspeed. This should KO. Yeah, we're... <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, it's, it's dead. <laughs> it's dead, Jim. It's dead. That's some good XP. We're gonna hit six off that. Uh, one one thing you may know, thunderous kick. That's a really good move. Um, we might want to get rid of U-turn for that. U-turn or guillotine. We can't over level anyway. So can guillotine actually hit anything? That's I mean, if it's under level, it's cool. But why is that only forty? Did they nerf it for this game? That's such a weird move to nerf. But it has 35 PP? What the heck? Oh, and it's Thunder Kick. Not Thunderous Kick. I'm going to get rid of Guillotine for, for Thunder Kick, I guess. But it says Thunder... Okay, but it does say Thunderous Kick. I'm not... I'm not oh, we almost leveled up twice off that. Cyborg hit 9. We have to be careful of levels. Um, the reason I'm using Stormwick is because it's the lowest right now. And on top of being the lowest level, um, if we hit fifth, oh, over 15, we can't use anyone in the gym that goes over that. So we have to make sure we're careful. Uh, let's go for, th I guess, Thunder Kick. Oh, I can't believe it's only 40. I feel like it's higher than that. Let me know down below if it is, because I feel like it is. Also, that'll be a question of the day. What is your favorite move in Pokemon? I When I was growing up, it was definitely uh, Blaze Kick. I thought Blaze Kick was just super cool. Uh, and then Overheat probably as well. I really liked a lot of the Gen 3 moves that they introduced there. But let me know down below what you think. I think they give a... I think we battle this person and they give us, like, Return or something. It's actually pretty cool. In the non-randomized version of this, they have, like, a full baby Pokemon team. Horsey, we can take that. Let me just go ahead and hit that with a Bolt Beak. Yeah, but I think I'm going to keep these around, like, 20 to 25 minutes. Um, I think that's a pretty good amount of time without it going too long. I definitely, like, I wanted to, like, watch the retention of the video. Uh, we use another Bolt Beak. And, um, that seems to be about a trend is around that time. So, maybe if we keep those around that, we'll, you guys will watch through. I know some of this is a little boring to watch, but I appreciate you watching through and enjoying the content. Liking, subscribing, commenting, all that jazz. It, it really means a lot to me. Uh, we'll hit it with the U-turn. Boop. Yeah, KO'd anyway. Yeah, Stormwind's gonna be a hard carry for a while. Okay, so we hit 8 off that. 
Almost nine. Okay. I think, uh, it's close as what, ten? Let's go ahead and get... Okay, so that... So let's see if that's randomized, if that's actually returned. Because I wouldn't be mad about that at all if it is. Yep. Yeah, okay. Return's not a bad move. Especially potentially late game. And we could swap it for something. Okay, let's check. Because we need to make sure we don't get over 15... 251 so you're pretty good off it's it, he's legendary too so he's gonna take a while to level up cyborg i do kind of worry could but he's probably fine oh and in case you didn't know and storm is fine uh and in case you don't know we do name our encounters that we catch after subscribers and people who comment that have funny comments down below so make sure to do both and uh yeah you could be next we're getting at least two or three today hopefully so let's see what we can get This one. This was in Route 30. Um. We did go to a new route, right? Now I'm questioning it. I mean, I'm not. I'll, I'll catch it, and if it's not Route 31, I thought I saw it change. If it's not Route 31, I will uh, release this. Uh, I'm just gonna try and check another ball. We need something that can do. We're gonna swap. Okay, that's fine. We need something that can do status, and we just don't have it. I don't think we have... Well, actually, it's water, so... Wow, we're not doing anything. Or it's not moving at all now. I hate to swap anything into this time pool with Behemoth Bash. It's gonna... It doesn't... It resists this, but it always crits. We're ten levels higher. I'm gonna chuck a couple more balls. Because we can take, like, a lot of these hits. I'll go to, like... Oh, my goodness. Really? I'll go to 30. Uh, on a level 4 time pull, this is what we're doing? Is it struggling? Well, that's something, I guess. Uh, we could swap. Stormwick. I kind of want to just stay in with Darkstone. Man, we could heal pulse it. Um... We don't copy HP, so we could turn into Time Pool. I'm kind of fine with Darkstone. It lost some HP. Let's throw another Pokeball. <sighs> Sweet. Time Pool's cool. Seismitoad's a really cool Pokemon. Um, especially if it keeps some of those moves. We'll hit 10 off that. And Bolt Strike. Oh, well, our physical attack's pretty, pretty dog water. But Time Pool could be a really cool addition to the team. I don't think we'll see it evolve before the gym, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I'll have to check that later. I'm going to name this after Suvna. Suvna, thank you for being a subscriber and commenting. Super appreciated. And Time Pool is a cool Pokemon. Let's see what we got. It's holding an item. A Petra Berry. Okay. Those are really good IVs. The nature's not stellar. Uh, but stamina is really good. I don't know if that'll change on evolving, but these are excellent IVs. So it did only have two moves. Giant Bash, which is Behemoth Bash, and then Ring Out. The more HP the target has, the greater the power, which is a really cool move. And Behemoth Bash uh, is a really good move, too. So that's a really good addition to the team. I'm going to go back and heal up. I also just didn't check and see if that was... Okay, yeah, it was a Route 31. Sweet. So that was a new route. I just wanted to verify that just in case. Better to be safe than sorry. Don't want to get flamed in the in the comment down below. <laughs> but Time Pool is definitely a super good addition. Uh, again, make sure you subscribe and comment down below to get a chance to also be named after our encounters. Because I super appreciate it and I love you all. Yeah, okay, so time pulls are in both routes. That's pretty crazy, actually. Uh, we gotta give you an Orin Berry. Stamina's really good, though. So every time we get hit, we get a defense raise. And, like, straight nines down the middle is pretty cool. Uh, we have bag. There we go. So we'll go ahead and give an Orin Berry to Suvna. Who will start leveling up using the EXP. We'll also go ahead and give it return. Just so it has a fourth move. 
Uh, same to Cy... Oh, I thought Cyborg only had three. No, yes. Okay. Well, okay. So that's four moves there. So there are, are there only time pulls? Oh, we could have caught a Litwick. I'm fine with uh, not though. I'm I'm fine with time pull. That's a cool Pokemon. That'll give us water and ground typing, which will be, I would say, good coverage. But like everything has random moves, so who's who's really to say? I guess. Um, I'll I'll lead. What are we? Seven, eight. I'll still lead Stormwick. We still don't have anything that can cause status. Is there a hidden item here? I'm going to kind of scout around for a hidden item while we're also getting our Dark Cave encounter. Okay. I am not mad about a Yen Mega. That is a cool Pokemon. I'm going to go for a Thunderous Kick. It has Tail Glow. That is terrifying. Okay. That is super terrifying. Uh, let's go for another one. It has Ember. Okay. So we can take those even at a plus three. I think as long as we don't crit, we can hit it like one or two more times even. Because we can take Embers all day. And we have an Orin Berry. So this is minus three Thunderous Kick. Okay. I should have bought more balls. We have 29. So it's at plus six now. Let's go for the Premier Ball. I don't think Premier Ball has a better catch rate. I'm pretty sure it's literally the same as a Pokeball. That's bad. So it only has Ember and Tail Glow. That's good to know. So we could just chuck these and probably be fine. All of our Pokemon besides Solosis resist that. It has Hurricane. That might KO Stormwick. Wow. That's bad. That really sucks. That's plus six. <sighs> Giratina can take it, but... I didn't expect that. I didn't expect that. We. I feel like we have to catch it now. <sighs> I can't believe we lost Stormwick to that. First death of the series. Super unfortunate. Sorry, Stormwick. We learned Howl? Okay. I'm just gonna... <sighs> you killed Stormwick, but... Yenmega's a really cool mon. Uh... Let me find a subscriber. Dr. Bubble Sponge. I'll name this Bubbles after you, buddy. Thank you for being a subscriber. Bubbles. That's super unfortunate. What do you got, Bubbles? Give me something good. Hardy? That's a neutral nature. Oh, it's Bug Dragon in this! Instead of Bug Flying. That's a... Or is it random typing? No, it's not. It can't be. Not Stellar. But it's got Tail Glow Ember Hurricane. Which is no longer stead because we're part dragon. Um, okay. Could be good. I'm really, I'm really sad about Stormwick. That's a that is a hefty loss. Uh, we'll lead, we'll lead Cyborg. I guess we'll lead Darkstone actually. Yeah, because we got to be careful now. Yeah. Do I just rush to the next town or do I run back? I think I can just wait. What what? Oh no, I forgot there's a battle here. I, I'm i dumb. Oh, they offer me a slowpoke tail that I can't afford for nine billion dollars. Oh man. We could wipe here. No, he only has one. For some reason I thought he had like five mons. Never mind, we're good. I think our rival fight will be pretty hard, but... Water bug. If only you were a little bit higher. Our team's pretty not great against that. Um, we got levels though, so I'll go ahead and just, I guess, arm thrust for multiple hits. Needle arm, yeah, we'll stay in. All right. 
do we have to do Sprout Tower? Okay, you're not a trainer. I was worried there for a second. Covet? Interested? Yes. No. <laughs> okay. Um, let's go ahead and heal up. We have an antidote. We have a potion. We'll go ahead and heal up bubbles. Because I think we do run into a tra uh, rival battle here in a second. I'm going to repel since this is still Route 31 to cut down on XP gain. This looks like a TM. Okay, so we get frustration and we get return this early. That's pretty cool. Any hidden? Okay, no, it's just a trainer right there. We're going to go up, try and avoid this trainer here. Oh, there's a trainer here. I think there normally is. Heart scale's cool. I'm assuming the move relearners are around here somewhere. Oh, actually, there's a move relearner in every Pokemon Center. I wonder if... Oh, this could be big. Wait a second. Hey there, kid. You taking the Pokemon Gym Challenge? That's great. I'm Primo. You may know me from my TV show, Show Me the Show. If you haven't seen... if Wait, bleh. If you haven't earned a single badge, you need to catch plenty of Pokemon before you take the gym challenge. Have some special balls. They're Primo balls. They really missed out on the opportunity to just give us Primo Premier balls. Alright, yeah, 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 yeah. Good TLA TV. Let's see something here. We'll heal up. Uh, no. Oh, the repel thing's in here. Sweet. Now I gotta bury our first friend. Taken way too early. Wallpaper. Let's see if, uh... Etc. Simple. A nice simple background. Just like he would have wanted it. <laughs> he was gonna be our hard carry. Oh, we need to rename it. Uh... He's dead. Yeah, that's, that's it. I think that's it. Sweet and simple. And I can't make a frowny face. It's not even a less than symbol? Man. Hmm. Well, we'll just go with dead then. So we can still get our Sprout Tower. We might be able to get our Azalea Ruins. Did I give him a berry? I did not. We need to give Bubbles a berry. So let's do that. We can't heal otherwise. Okay. So I guess we head to Sprout Tower for our next encounter. Um, You're both seven, right? Yeah, you're seven. Brave, stamina. The cool move. That raises attack, right? Yeah, so this raises attack. I'm going to lead Darkstone still, just because it's so bulky. Let's see if they're... I think someone trades here. Let's see if it's, like, still... Do you trade? I guess not. I really thought the trader was down here. I think you can normally get, like, an Onyx for a Bell Sprout or something. So I thought maybe that was still a thing. Okay, you're... Okay, so we can't d take on the gym. Do you give us something? The best place... I absolutely do, Earl. Please take me to the best place in the city. You're my hero, Earl. The school? I would absolutely love to go to school. Hello. Oh, it's your school? This is biased. That, though, that's not bad. Okay, so we get a crit ratio boost. That's, that's not bad. I can't be too mad about that. Uh, so, Giratina auto crits. Um... I'll probably keep berries for now. We'll see what level we end up. Because we need to make sure we don't hit level 10, uh, 15. Or, 16. We need to make sure we don't hit 16. I think we can avoid the trainers in the gym. Let's see if we can get another encounter before we head into Sprout Tower, though. Uh, I'm also going to buy some Pokeballs. Because I think we should have gotten some money from those trainer battles. We can buy 20. Or, 10. For 2,000. And that gets us Premier Ball. Okay. You do not feel comfortable. Oh man, I'm sorry, bro. Hope you find some comfort soon. Maybe if you subscribe to Mr. Bagel Bites, you will find comfort in his soothing, natural, beautiful voice. 
A polywhirl for a jinx. That would be a sick trade that I would normally take advantage of. I would if I had a polywhirl, ma'am, but there are no polywhirls around here that I'm aware of. Uh, we can normally go down, but I feel like this is blocked with a berry tree. Yeah, we don't have a rod. What do you give us? Chesto berries? <sighs> okay. So we can't get anything down there, and I feel like this is blocked. Ooh, it's not? Wait, how'd I get in? Good. Thanks, man. What a sweetheart. Oh. Team Rocket. Oh, we battle them down there. I remember this. We definitely want to avoid them, but we can get another encounter right here. And then if we take care of the tree for this guy later, he gives us something. So let's see what we can get for our probably second to last encounter. We already have a time pull. So this is Dupes Claws. We, we don't have to catch this. <laughs> So we're just going to go ahead and knock this bad boy. Oh, that's right. Stamina's going to give it a boost each time. We do get five hits, though, which is pretty cool. Look at you go. Darkstone hit 11. Okay. Let's let's go again. F Florgus. Fairy. Fairy grass. We need to swap. Man, that even sucks for bubbles, because he's dragon. This typing's actually killing us. Uh, we'll, we'll go to Cyborg. Cyborg's pretty bulky. Solosis is, even though it's only level 10. It has Rock Throw. That shouldn't do too much. That, it has Parental Bond. That or they buffed Rock Throw. Um, I'm fine with going for a Bolt Strike for the small chance of Paralysis here. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's bad. That's probably going to KO. <gasps> Barry might save us. Barry might save us. Oh, that's huge. Oh, that's huge. We didn't get the paralysis. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we're swapping back to Darkstone. And this, thing, and this thing's level 9. Petal Dance, we take those. Parental Bond Florgus. That's pretty crazy. I doubt this KOs, even if we get five hits. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Okay, it's confused. I'm going to take advantage and go for the uh, Premier Ball here. That Mr. Primo is generous enough to lend us. Dude, why is the catch rate on everything so hard? Okay, it hurt itself, puts it in yellow. Hopefully, and this thing still doesn't have anything to, uh... Oh, thank god. I was gonna say cost status effect. 386, that's so much XP. Oh, we're gonna have to put Cyborg up. Nine... Stockpile? Oh? I don't hate it. I don't hate it. But I don't love it. Yeah, we're gonna not. Bubbles hit eight. And we get Florgus. Alright, let me find a subscriber to name Florgus after. Uh, there was somebody who's commented on the last couple. One, uh, it's 1TS, so I'm pretty sure it's it's too easy. So we're gonna name this bad boy Easy. Or t You know what? I'll, I'll, I'll go back. Give me one sec. Let's go. Two... E Z Almost lost our boy to you. I really should have used the repel there. I got I got really scared there for a second, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> we and it was level nine, so it was and I think that means it was the highest level we could have encountered in that area, which is just terrifying. Pedal dance, it's not stab, but it is really strong of a uh, of a move. We might still have full team for for a uh, guy whose name I can't think of right now. Hardy. Is it the second Hardy? Great. Two Hardys. S special attack SHP. 
B plus defense, A attack, which sucks. Special defense is pretty bad, but it has good natural special defense, so that's good. Parental bond is um, bonkers. <gasps> that's disgusting. This thing is gross. <laughs> this is this <laughs> this is gross. <laughs> you know, think about it like this. Imagine Mega Kangaskhan had access to like Swords Dance. So it could get plus two. For those of you who don't play competitive Pokemon, this thing is actually insane. Like, I thought Heatmore was going to be insane. This thing may put it to shame. You know what? We're at 25, but I really kind of want to get our uh, our Sprout Tower encounter. So we're going we're gonna to go to Sprout Tower. We're going to get our Sprout Tower encounter, and then we'll probably wrap the episode. Hopefully I can uh, not lose Florgus too. To, oh, do we give a berry to Solosis to replace the berry we lost? Sick. Um, I imagine anything that it hits can't be KO'd by... I think we can counter on this floor. We most certainly can. Not exactly what I wanted, but it's typing or a break. Okay, so that sucks. Bad ability. Um, kind of a cool mon, I guess. We'll get locked into that. Rock throw probably KOs. <laughs> um, we can't do those. This is like the worst thing we could have run into. A bug and a flying type. Um, Darkstone should be fine against it. The other reason I say that is because, uh... It should resist, and I don't think Karate Chop can. Aerial Lace is cool that it has, though, so it has a stab move. I'm fine with going for Arm Thrusts here. Oh, yeah, that does, like, nothing. Needle Arm. Okay, so it has Grass Coverage. So we can even get five more. Alright, this thing shouldn't have too high of a catch rate. I'm gonna go for the Premier Ball, because I like Premier Balls. Maybe. Okay. Alright. Be that way. Bestow? I actually don't know what that move does. I'm gonna go for the uh, the arm thrust again. I really want to get this thing in red. Yeah, okay, that's fine. <sighs> Dude, the catch rate. The catch rate in this game needs nerfed. I mean, I know it's a fully evolved Pokemon, but it's a Vivalon in the red. And it's shaking one time. Alright. Let me just... I, I know we don't. I know we don't have anything that can cause status. We'll just... I'll just speed up till we catch it. Because it's not dealing any damage to us. And we can't do anything to it. Okay, there we go. Thank God. Oh my... Oh, but, oh, but Darkstone's getting all the XP. 12. But look at those stats! And Bubbles hits 9. Okay. We find a subscriber for Vivalon, who could hard carry in the next gym. Could be interesting. Wanted to see. We're gonna name this after. T Man! I'll name this after my boy T Man. There we go. Thank you, T Man. We're gonna go ahead and walk down the steps check out our new friend and we'll probably wrap it there unless I like just throw the game or something have a lot of we at least we hopefully at least we should hopefully have a full team for Morty or not Morty whatever the person uh, is in the first hit in the in the like, down whatever this gym is um bug flying okay so no nat naughty nature that's bad Ivies aren't terrible or a break is a bad ability though unless we run into some like crazy Oramon, but that's not happening. It had Vine Whip and Needle Arm. Okay, so we have Grass Coverage, which is pretty cool. I don't know what Bestow does. Passes its held item to the target when the target isn't holding an item. So we could give it something bad, but we don't really get those in this game. An Aerial Ace for actual stab coverage, which is pretty cool. Because we're actually going to have to be an attacker. Because <laughs> we're naughty nature. Okay. Alright. I'm not... I, I don't hate it. I'm not thrilled, but I don't hate it. We have a pretty cool team. It sucks that we lost Stormwick. 
he'd definitely still be on the team, but I'm not opposed to seeing uh, a flying coverage on the team since, for some reason, yeah, Mega is a dragon in this game. But we're going to go ahead and wrap it there. We hit a half hour. Thank you guys so much for tuning in today's episode. If you enjoyed what you saw, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button to stay up to date on Mr. Bagel Bites content. Super helps out the channel and myself. If you want to share it to your grandma, friends, mother, whatever, blah, 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 blah. I'd super appreciate it because... Wait a second. This might be relevant. Oh my goodness. Yes. Powder? What is powder? That explodes if you use the fire type of what? Uh, we're gonna get sleep powder. Yeah, this isn't cheating. I don't, I, no, this is an available resource in the game. We're getting rid of bestow for sleep powder, and it looks like we finally have a uh, <laughs> a move. Oh my goodness! I'm probably gonna do a little. Um, I'm probably gonna do a little. Uh, little playing around there see what we can get and kind of pump our moves up since we actually can learn our moves since they're final of all pokemon but thank you guys so much seriously for tuning in you guys are great i love you so much and uh yeah as always catch you later i can't and there we go have a great day guys